are you doing today? This is Rich here on behalf of Rich TV Live, and I have a very special guest, the CEO of Patriot One Technologies, Martin Cronin. How are you doing today, Martin? Very well, thanks. Thanks for having me on. Thank you for being here. Why don't we just get started with you telling us a little bit about Patriot One Technologies? Great, thank you. Well, Patriot One is in the business of uh, public safety. We're bringing forward innovations uh, in sensor hardware, coupled with machine learning, to detect concealed and overt threats, guns, knives, bombs, uh, chemical threats, um, in real time and networking the alarms to put the information where it needs to be so that we can make a major difference to public safety. That's great. Now, you guys have been working with some really big names. Can you explain to us a little bit about how some of their experiences have been using your platform with, the, for example, IBM, Raytheon, just to mention a few? Sure. Well, I think it's fair to say that we've, we've captured the imagination of some very major players in the market. And I think the reason for that is the fact that we take a fundamentally different approach to public safety, to the conventional means of, of threat detection. We're in a business of low cost, embedded, ubiquitous sensors, networking data, putting alarms where they need to be. And that is a fundamentally different approach. And it's, and it's fired the imagination of some major players. So we're just delighted to be working with the likes of Raytheon, who of course are just a huge international player in radar. Uh, they're supporting our, our, our radar-based development and have put in $3 million of non diluted financing. Cisco, just a tremendous partner, supporting our development uh, through their um, partner program, the, uh, what's called the Innovation Partner Program. We're doing joint development work with them. We're out together with Cisco in front of some, some major clients. Uh, IBM supporting us uh, through their startup at IBM program, where we have access to Watson, to their machine learning tools, to their cloud-based processing. And then we have another, a number of other very major partnerships coming through the pipeline that uh, we'll, we'll be announcing news on as and when we can. So fair to say, I think the, the major global players with an interest in this space have really honed in on what we're doing, and they really like what we're doing. I also like what you're doing. And where do you see the security industry headed in the future? And what's Patreon, Patriot One's role in driving these changes? Well, I think one of the fundamental issues that uh, everyone is wrestling, is, uh, wrestling with is where is the balance between civil liberty and surveillance for public safety? You know, people want to be safe. We, you know, the, the, the stories come through on a all too frequent basis of horrific terrorist attacks or disturbed individuals with, with weapons, school shootings. It, it's just horrific and people want solutions. At the same time, there is a limit to their tolerance for uh, uh, having civil liberties taken away. So there's a, there's a sweet spot. We've seen a lot of news stories around uh, concern about Facebook or concern about facial recognition in San Francisco. And so I think we occupy that, that healthy balance um, where the public can be comfortable with the notion that they are being made safer that their civil liberties are, are being protected. That I think is where the industry is trying to get to and where I think we've, we have a natural advantage because that's been our whole philosophy from the outset. That's great. Now you're in a very competitive industry. Can you explain to me some of the competitors in your sector and what makes you guys unique? Sure, well, first of all, you know, let me start by saying we, we wish anybody well who's out there trying to make a difference for public safety. There are some great companies out there you know, with their own innovations in the main, however, other companies uh, looking at how to detect threats are in the business of um, fixed visible security infrastructure, a particular piece of hardware that can effectively detect threats. We take a different approach, which is what we call the multi-sensor platform approach, where we have a number of different types of technology that um, gather data in different ways, overlaid with some machine learning. So in other words, artificial intelligence making sense of data from different sensors. And in that way, we can really uh, uh, adapt and customize the solution to the particular client requirement, to the particular environment. And by virtue of taking data from different sensors, we can put together a composite picture, which is really the gold standard in, in detection. That I think is, is, is what makes us different. I think that's great. Now, we're having all kinds of issues with privacy. I know Facebook's been all over the news about privacy. How are you able to maintain privacy with your company in a time where privacy is so rare? Yeah, it's a great question. I mean, our approach is we're interested in detecting threats. And so we're not looking at a person and saying, hmm, 
I don't like the look of them. Perhaps they have, you know, bad, bad intent. We're detecting threats. We're detecting weapons where they shouldn't be. Um, uh, and essentially saying, okay, here is a threat. Now the person becomes of interest. So we're capturing their personal data. We're not um, taking images of, uh, of, of innocent people going about their daily business. We uh, capture no personal information, store no personal information, and transmit no personal information. So our systems pose absolutely no threat to ordinary members of the public going about their ordinary business, and we retain no record of any of those people going about their business. So in that way, we can maintain that balance between civil liberties and effective public safety. So what's on the horizon for Patriot One? Any upcoming news right now? Yeah, we've, uh, we've got some pretty good news flow going right now. You would have seen our announcement this morning. We're tremendously pleased to release details of the licensing agreement with Quasar Federal Systems. This is uh, another highly innovative um, piece of sensor hardware that we've been evaluating for some time now for inclusion in our platform. It's another just tremendous plank for what we do. We can run with it very quickly because it requires no FCC certification, unlike you know our radar-based solutions. Um, we have other innovations that are under evaluation. So you'll see news on new elements of the platform, um, better ways of tying the data together, uh, sensor fusion. You'll see news on key partnerships, key clients coming through. This is just a tremendously exciting time for, for Patreon One, and we, we really can't wait to share all of that with, uh, with, um, with the community who've been following us for some time. I can't wait to see all the news unfold. Now, for anyone that is interested in learning more about your company, what's the best way for them to follow you and reach out to you? The best uh, way is through our website. Um, we keep it up to date. It's a comprehensive site, www.patriot1, that's a numeral one, tech.com. People will find their contact information details. They'll find our newsletters. They'll see uh, information sheets on all of our technologies. Um, they'll see articles that we've written. That will give them a really good sense of who we are, what we're doing, and where we're going. Wow, I'm really impressed with what you guys are doing. I think the world needs more of what you're doing. So congratulations on all your success so far. Thank you for being here on Rich TV Live. And we just want to wish you all the best of luck on your future endeavors. We will be watching our entire community. And thank you, Martin, for joining us today. Have yourself a great day. It's been my pleasure. Thank you very much. That is Martin Cronin, the CEO of Patriot One Technologies. Have a nice day.